love you, baby, but can you turn that off for a bit? Yes. Thank you. That's not good. That might be better. Focus. Focus on me. Just me. Me. I've been trying to actually make another YouTube video since Christmas. But the only thing we got of Christmas now that it doesn't really matter anymore is. I work now. Stop watching me. You want me in the shot? That's it. All right, but we're gonna go ahead and do that. What I want to do today was show off the house because, like, even though it's not like amazing or anything, it's amazing to me because it's my very first house I've ever bought and. I'm basically broke right now, and I'm really trying to make it happen. We have a couple of things around here that we can look at, and have some fun with, and look at. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> All right. Our bathroom. <laughs> I mean, the bathroom! So we got towels like any other standard human would need. We got a shower. Very standard. The hot water does not last long enough for me to meditate on anything, so you just get clean and you fucking leave. We're camping. And this is some of my makeup stuff. I did my makeup recently, and that's what it looks like after I do my makeup, because I leave it everywhere and then I pick it up later. Oh, and these actually were what I got for Christmas. Thanks, Mom. And, of course, every bathroom looks like this, because whenever you're getting your face clean, you need at least like 70 different tools to actually accomplish it because your skin's in different moods every day of the year. Okay, established. Coconut oil. You can use it for everything. Your skin's dry. Anything's dry. Put the coconut oil on it. You will not suffer. <coughs> your suffering will end. <laughs> You'll finally be free. Hand sanitizer. Because everything's gross. I mean, everything in between everything. Especially if you're touching your eyes. Is where I do the unsanitary part of my thing. Where I grab my little brushes and I go like this in between my colors. <laughs> to get them clean. So I can put on more pigment. <laughs> pigment. Yeah, I have been away from society for like three years in like a mental prison. So now I'm loose and I'm getting back into things. And I'm learning all kinds of new things. Down with our bathroom. This doesn't work. This is our little breakfast nook, eating nook category. That's actually Gekegami from the game. He was like the god of lightning and helped you like, get thunder powers. And I thought since the cure was thunderous, that might actually matter slightly. And pizza, because pizza fuels all. I don't actually think anyone wants to see that. <laughs> I don't know. It's like showing off old pizza. Um, People take photos day of. Challenge accepted. My Instagram's gonna be full of Dale Pizza. No one's gonna follow me! <laughs> I get it. It's artistic integrity. Do for me. I should have turned on the lights for this ages ago. Girls <laughs> things! We're still moving in a little bit. And we're going to get rid of this couch and kind of try and turn it into the editing pit in a little bit. Cash money, Benny. We don't got that yet. And here is what I have been foolishly spending money on in my past three years of my mental prison. I bought enamel pins. This is a little coffee bean. Oh yeah, and all the windows are covered because once again, this is an RV. We're just, it's my crackman. We are just trying to keep the heat in it in any way we can. Windows, understandable. Oh, but this is my landscape. It makes the ground soft whenever I cannot stand anymore because I work like 40 hours a week and only recently have I convinced people to make that less. <laughs> this is our beds! That's beds for people, that's beds for dog. Dog stays in that bed sometimes, usually sneaks in at night. Uh. I won't do one of these. <laughs> and I stopped chain melting. All my little amiibos and my sweet little uh, Team Skull Pikachu and the little uh, minis. I really want all the minis. Like, if they come out with the N64 mini, I have to run off with that. And here's some of Cole's Hot Wheel collection. So they're all over the place instead of. No, they're not! They're all lined up! They're not for display! They're that's perfect! That's not perfect! It's that's like looking books at a bunch on of. Shelf. Exactly, it's shit. I'm 
like this is a, a model of something. It needs to be facing me. So this show came more for GameStop. So they'll literally give me like 16 of these any time I come in. So if anyone needs, we got tons of the Zior code. They're just not doing us any good here because we said we were going to restart our games and try and get all these Pokemon. It is not worth it. You have until a little bit after my birthday to ask me about these codes, okay? If you really give a shit. Hit me up. Again, DM me on Twitter. Easiest way to get in contact. Again, the setup I have is so prehistoric. So, like, half of my social media can't function properly. Twitter is literally the guaranteed way to contact me right now. Anything else, you're probably gonna wait a couple of days. And it's not even on purpose. I love you. I just can't open it. Here, because this is where I actually edit, is in this bed. I set up, like, my little fucking table over there. And. Nope, can't look over there. Can't look over there. <laughs> edit. You can look at our towel of suspicious nature and make your assumptions about Life's overwhelming! You're allowed to go, you know, I feel annoyed. And then you can remove yourself from that situation. And last but not least, we got this. This is my coin jar. Like any up and coming should have. You should be saving every nickel you happen to run into physically because they smell bad and you hate holding them physically. And so you put them in a jar to separate them from yourself and also accumulate them. And if you have a nasty old like bank account somewhere, they usually have those little like coin counters in those banks, physical banks. Go with them. Go to them. Find them. Don't use the ones in the stores because they'll charge you a bunch of money and they'll take some of your coins. And this is where we stick our coats. Which is where we were supposed to stick the TV originally, but our TV was fucking beefy because we had bought it like two, four years before. <sighs> the TV that we have here is basically the one we've always had. We've had this since we've known each other. Like, since before we've known each other, this TV has been running around in Cole's life. And now it's mine. I don't wear them when I'm editing because I feel like it's a magnifying glass directly into my corneas that will further damage my eyes. So I'm like, great, everything I want to do for the rest of my life involves my eyes a little bit and my hands. And my two weakest features are my hands and my eyes. Hey, I was designed to be on this planet. <laughs> I was meant to be here. Why am I broken? I love this little teeny sweater. This is my saber tooth skull. It's a replica and I'm fine with that because that makes it $50 instead of $50,000. At least he lands upright. <laughs> Literally everything I had to show when I came to the house. Like, if there's anything that costs cr anything crossing your mind, Cole? Because I don't really want to step outside because I don't want to give you the location just yet. It's cold, too. It's cold as shit. Okay, so thank you for checking out my video on my house because it's cool to start things and go places and show where you came from and have a history. And thank you for moving the camera towards your face so I can look up right a little bit. Thank you. Till next time. Bye.